fellow riders and Honda enthusiasts. Welcome back to my YouTube channel, the go-to spot for all things on two wheels. Today, we've got something special in the spotlight, a machine that's set to redefine the thrill of the ride, the all-new Honda Forza 750. So, if you're revved up about the latest in the world of motorcycles, you're in the right place. Buckle up, because we're about to dive deep into the features, performance, and everything that makes the Honda Forza 750 the talk of the town. But before we hit the road, make sure to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on the latest updates from the world of biking. All right, let's get this engine started. Crowning the prestigious Forza range, the Forza 750 is the ultimate city slicker offering an exciting ride and luxurious comfort wrapped in high-tech style. It's a big bore scooter that impresses in all arrears. Effortless acceleration is on tap from its torquey 745cc twin cylinder engine equipped with throttle by wire, three default riding modes, and three-level Honda selectable torque control. A tubular steel frame, aluminum swing arm, pro-link rear suspension, and 1715-inch front rear wheels provide sure-footed handling with strong braking from dual radial mount four-piston front calipers. The under-seat storage will hold a full-face helmet and houses a USB charger. All lighting is LED and a 5-inch TFT display allows smartphone connectivity via the new Honda smartphone voice control system. A 35KW version is also available for A2 license holders. For 23YM, three new contemporary paint options. Matte Ballistic Black Metallic, Pearl Glare White, and Iridium Gray Metallic. Keep the Forza 750 fresh and further enhance its desirability. Model Overview. The Forza 750's svelte yet curvaceous bodywork offers ample high-speed wind protection, plenty of rider legroom and low seat height without excess bulk. The under-seat storage space will take a full-face helmet and is equipped with a USB charging point. There's also a handy glove box. A TFT instrument display offers Honda smartphone voice control system linking the rider to their smartphone. Ignition, locking, and seat opening is via smart key. Powered by a torquey, fuel-efficient 745cc twin-cylinder engine, throttle by wire allows adjustable engine character through three default rider modes, rain, standard and sport, plus a customizable user mode, Honda selectable torque. Control offers a fine level of intervention over three levels, while the standard fit dual clutch transmission features automatic shifting schedules that link with the riding modes. A tubular steel frame, aluminum swing arm, 41mm USD forks, radial mount four-piston brake calipers, Pro-Link rear suspension, and 15-inch, 17-inch front rear wheel combination comprise the well-equipped chassis and deliver sports motorcycle levels of handling in scooter form, styling, and equipment. Classy and roomy GT styling provides weather protection for rider and pillion. 22L storage space includes USB charger with easy to access front glove box. Honda smartphone voice control system offers smartphone link through new five inch TFT display. All lighting is LED. The front indicators and mirrors are body mounted. Ignition, lock operation and seat opening via smart key. As befits a GT scooter, the Forza 750's sleek front fairing mounts the mirrors and front indicators and provides ample wind protection for high-speed cruising without the type of excessive bulk that hinders around town agility. The screen, two cocoons rider and pillion in a tranquil pocket of air. But on top of the all-important riding functionality, and as head of the sophisticated Forza family, the Forza 750 is also a rolling statement of aspiration, with style that exudes premium appeal and a presence that will attract attention whenever and wherever it's ridden. Of course, the practical details matter. There's plenty of legroom up front, while the carefully contoured seat is instantly comfortable and also ensures easy ground reach. Seat height is set at 790 mm. The under-seat luggage space has 22L volume and accepts a full-face helmet. A USB charging socket is located at the rear of the compartment. There's also a useful and easy-to-access glove compartment in the right-side inner fairing. Incorporated into the rider interface and viewed through the 5-inch TFT display, 
is the Honda Smartphone Voice Control System, which links the rider to their smartphone while on the move and allows voice management of phone calls, email, music, and navigation. A helmet-mounted headset is needed, and the smartphone connects to the dash via Bluetooth. Management of Honda Smartphone Voice Control is also possible from buttons on the left switch gear. For added convenience, the Forza 750 uses a smart key, which lives in the rider's pocket and does away with the need to use a key for ignition, fuel cap, and seat. With the smart key present, one push of the knob-type main switch powers it up and makes it possible to turn, giving the rider control of the ignition steering lock and, via two rocker switches, the fuel cap and seat. It also locks and unlocks the optional smart top box and has an answer back function, which makes the indicators flash for easy identification from a distance. A clutch mechanism in the main switch stops the handlebars unlocking by force. The rear indicators have an emergency stop signal, ESS, function. If negative acceleration of 6.0 Meller S2 is detected at a minimum speed of 53 kWh with either brake working, the hazard lights flash to warn other road users a hard stop is in process. At the same speed, the threshold is reduced if ABS is activated to a negative acceleration of a minimum 2.5 MS2. They also auto-cancel. Rather than using a simple timer, the system compares front and rear wheel speed difference and calculates when to cancel the indication relative to the situation. Engine, peak power of 1kW with 69 nm torque and 7,000 RPM redline, throttle by wire engine management, Euro 5 compliant with 27.8 Kemmler L possible, WMTC mode, 35kW A2 license version available, the design of the Forza 750's liquid-cooled SOHC 8-valve parallel twin-cylinder engine ensures punchy performance in the low to mid-range. Its relatively long-stroke architecture and specially shaped combustion chambers combine with the high inertial mass crankshaft to produce large amounts of effortless torque from very low RPM. Twin balancers counteract vibration from higher RPM inertia without affecting the distinct throb delivered by the engine's irregular firing order and 270 degree phased crankshaft. Bore and stroke is set at 70D7T80mm, where possible components are made to do more than one job. The camshaft drives the water pump, while one of the balancer shafts drives the oil pump. By keeping the number of parts to a minimum in this way, the engine is kept light, efficient, and reliable. Chassis. Tubular steel diamond frame, 41 mm USD fork, pro-link suspension and aluminum swing arm, radial mount four-piston front brake calipers, 310 mm discs and ABS, 17 15-inch cast aluminum front and rear wheels. For core strength, the Forza 750 uses a rugged tubular steel diamond frame, which neatly packages all ancillaries and gives ample space for the underseat storage area. Rake and trail are set at 27 to Dodds 104 mm with wheelbase of 1590 mm. Overall wet weight is 235 quillars. The spring preload adjustable rear shock is a single tube split pressure design and operates the aluminum swing arm constructed from a machined hollow cross member and U-shaped in cross-section arms through ProLink. The 17-inch front and 15-inch rear cast aluminum wheels deliver confident handling and stability. Tires are sized 120-70 R17 and 160-60 R15 front and rear. Dual radial mount opposed four piston calipers grip 310 millimeter discs and work through ABS. This is it for today's video. What do you think of our video? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more future updates. Thanks for watching.